Chelsea, I know how to find Malthale, but you will not like what I have to tell you. I rarely do. Why don't you just tell me? There is only one person who knows how to find Malthale. She waits for you in the Blood Marsh, and you know her well. Adria. Adria. Finally. You're not going anywhere without me. Oh, really? And why is that? Someone has to make sure you don't kill Adria before you find out where Malthael is. I shall try to restrain myself, but make no... I have delivered the city of Westmarch from Urzael and his Reapers. The people are now free to rebuild their homes and their lives. Lorath and I depart for the Blood Marsh to find Adria. She, of all people, knows how to locate Malthael. I will take great joy in extracting that information before I kill her. We hid the Black Soul Stone in the deepest part of the Nephilim ruins near here. We thought it would be safe, but Malthael found it all the same. Do you know what fear is? Fear of who you are. Fear of what your own blood would do if they knew what you were. No, you could never understand it. People look to you as a savior. Have you ever thought about the line? This is the entrance to the tomb, but someone's collapsed. Our friend, Adria. It looks like we'll have to find another way into the ruins. What was that? Something is coming. This was just one entrance to the city. There are guide stones littered across the blood marsh that will lead us to the main one. The guide stones are useless to most, but we'll reveal the correct path to a Nephilim such as yourself. Nothing will keep me from ending your life, Adria. Remember to get the information we need before you... Yes, yes. Information first, and then killing. Well... That's very reassuring. This is one of the guide stones. Nothing happens when I approach it. They asked me what I see when I look into the fire. I see a burning man. There are four entrances to the Nephilim city. Each one etched with a sigil. Only the correct one marks the true entrance to the tomb, however. When you activate these stones, one of the wrong sigils disappears. Then all we need to do is eliminate two of the remaining sigils. I must find another guide stone to determine which sigil is the correct one. marks the correct passage. Need more time. This is the passage for which I've been searching.
coming up. Gifted with long life, magic, and abilities far beyond ours. Yet they were still men. I, I wonder if these pages hold the key to unlock their powers once again. Bring the light of Zakarum to the heathens. Here in the east, the power of Zakarum wanes, but in the west, it will rise, stronger and greater than ever. Yet I have another purpose. The Lorak, this is as far as you go. We will speak again when it is finished. You're going to kill her, aren't you? I know what I need to do. We are all counting on you. waiting.
not ready yet. Your defenses are nothing. Still waiting. Let's see where you've been hiding, Malfiel. Adria. The angels will never suffer us to live. They cannot accept the fact that we may choose our own path. At least demons are not so rigid in their beliefs. My bags are full. Before she died, Adria conjured an image of pandemonium. She was searching for Malthael, so he must be there. I am returning to town. I have discovered that Malthael is in Pandemonium. No doubt he has gone to the fortress. Malthael can hold out there until the end of time. He is forcing us to come to him. He hides and waits, hoping that if he can delay us long enough, he will grow too powerful even for me. The only way to Pandemonium is through the High Heavens. Let us leave at once. <laughs> 